Oh my god, I'm about to lose my mind. I'm about to lose. I'm, I'm about to fucking go bananas. Yeah, I'm about to go off the wall. Um, <laughs> I'm about. To, I'm gonna. I'm gonna pull out my hair. I'm growing my hair out, and I'm gonna start pulling it out. Oh my god, I've spent. So this was supposed to be. Well, oh, let me back up. Let me. <laughs> A lot of things have been has been really, really grinding my fucking gears. Okay, grinding them. Fuck! Oh my god, just all oh, there. There's. Grinding. Okay, I'm. Oh god. Oh god. First off, I have fever. I think. I think I have a little fever. I think I'm. Un I'm a little under the weather. I blame it on insomnia and and, and stress and stuff. Um. Mm. I don't know. But um. But here's okay. So this all began at the beginning of the week. I don't know when I'll post post this. You know. Well, I know. I do know. I have a schedule now. It's gonna be a Friday. In two weeks, this is gonna go up. Hey, I was gonna do the state of the play. The state of play happened today. Um, for Sony or whatever. And I was gonna do a podcast about it, but then I was like, but then I, but I'd break my my rhythm, you know? I, cause my my schedule, I've been doing like uploading a podcast, then a video, then a podcast, and just back and forth like that, you know? Um, you know, just just back and forth. And if I do a state of play, I, I posted a, a podcast last week. This week is video, and it's Warhammer, and I can't do two podcasts in a week. It'll it'll fuck up my whole thing, you know. Um, so that's I'm still gonna talk about some state of the play stuff, but it's it's just gonna be late. This all began at the beginning of the week, okay? I I <laughs> I had to, I got my new microphone, right? My I got two little little portable mics that I got for my video project. But I thought use them for podcasting might be fun because I used it for my Mario podcast. I clipped it on on the Game Boy Advance SP, and it worked fine. It worked good, and I was like, maybe, maybe I could use this for podcasting. And then I saw at the beginning of the fucking week, I saw a tweet of, you know, here's the top five podcasts on Spotify or whatever. Fuck you, Spotify. If you're listening, fuck you. I don't like you anyway. Um, <laughs> maybe it's not Spotify. Maybe it's just podcasts in general. I'm looking at his fucking top five list and his fucking um, Ro Joe Rogan and fucking Candace Owens. Is that her name? There's a, the, the, another guy. The fucking... I don't know. I don't even know. They're, they're a bunch of weird, weirdo, right-wing, insane people. Oh, and then the, the Hawk 2 girl was on there, number, number four. And if she... I mean, she annoys the hell out of me. I think she, she's the most annoying person I've ever, maybe not the most, but overall she's pretty wholesome, I think. Um, I don't, I don't blame her for, you know, getting the bag. Here in the bag, fucking milk it as long as you can. You send one funny thing at one time, milk it, you know, go for it. I'm not going to listen to the podcast because it's, like I said, she, <laughs> I've seen a couple clips and she, insufferable, I think. But, um, not personally, I guess, just as an entertainer. I mean, I'm, I don't know her as a person. Anyway, it's weird. I was looking at this fucking list, and I was like, they fucking snubbed Happy Creator Inc. again. I should be on this list. But then I remembered I, I'm not. And, and, like, Joe Rogan, for example, fucking insane. But, like, he's pretty entertaining. Him and his guests, you know? I don't have any guests. And I can't go on long spiels about taking fucking magic mushrooms. And the moon landing is, a, is fake. And all this, you know, random bullshit. Because it's just ridiculous. <laughs> so I'm, I can't really compete with the the insaneness and, and the entertainment value of the train wreck. Of watching the train wreck, you know? I should be on the damn list, though. I'm pretty funny. Kinda. And stuff. Am I, though? I don't know. But I was just... I was, okay, this is what it's triggered me, okay? I was like... I want to increase the quality of my podcast you know i've been doing podcasting a long time and talking my commentary is okay ish and i I, just, I need better quality you know and until i have the space to make my own studio which is just a little desk i have an idea of how it's gonna look i'm gonna craft a desk and a, and a 
mic stand and stuff and get a laptop or something and have a have a nice setup to make video podcasts podcast and video type things never understood that at the time because like if it's a podcast why are you doing a video but it's kind of nice to have the video to watch because i can't just listen to something and close my fucking eyes like a goddamn 1920s housewife listening to fucking you know whatever the the world of world shit on the fucking radio i can't do that you know I need visual things. Um, I mean, I do listen to podcasts, but then I also... I don't I don't that often, because I need the visual things. So it's like, I listen to something, and I, I gotta play a game, or clean in the background, but then I can't really pay attention to the podcast, so it's like, not really a point. Um, but I was like, I want to upgrade the quality of my podcast. I take my little mic, and I was like, I'm gonna... I'm gonna finally figure out what the fuck is wrong with... I because. I used to have my old iPhone, right? I'd put it on the tripod between the TV and myself because I have a chair to sit in and it would pick up. It would do like a microphone would. Ooh, Counter-Strike Global Offensive has finished installing. That's what I was going to play during this, uh, this, uh, this podcast. The PS3 version. The long, long abandoned PS3 version of CSGO. Um, to test it, you know, I gotta test, but before we jump into it, (laughs) I gotta get my rant over, because I, I used to do that, right, worked fine, the, the mic, the voice recorder on the iPhone worked like you would expect it, you click the record button, and it, I don't know, fucking shockingly records the sounds around it, you know, I got this Android phone though, and it did work for a while, I think, but for some reason, it's like, you know, come to think of it, I don't know how interesting it is to hear tech problems. But, ooh, Front Mission 3 installed too. Nice. Um, I don't know how interesting it is to, to hear about the tech problems, but, uh, oh, it's downloading didn't install. I'll install that while I talk. But I'm gonna do it anyway, because it's, it's frustrating. But, but now, when I, you, I would set up my phone on the tripod, my Android phone, set in the chair... It's like the thing would only pick up my voice. It was like the voice recorder. Because I don't think this phone came with the voice recorder um, app already installed. I had to get get like a third party one. It was like it would isolate my voice. And, and like completely mute any background noise. Which that could be nice. You know? I can see the application of that. Very, you know? Very, very useful. You know, if you're don't want to hear background noise while you're talking, you know? Recording a voice memo or whatever, or, you know, you're spying on your ex and you got your phone under the fucking thing and you, I mean, that would, you would need it for the background noise then. So it wouldn't be applicable, applicable in, in that situation. There's situations where it would, but for my purposes, it fucks everything up, you know? It's, it's absolutely not what I want. And, um, so I, like, I chalked it up to, like, I, just, I can't, I couldn't, I can't record like I normally do. So, you know, I adapt. I'm an adapter. And I'm not a fucking Apple headphone adapter because those break every goddamn month. I know from the babe. We have to buy her one every month. They always break. I'm sure, I think they're designed that way, honestly. The planned obsolete, you know. I guess I am like that. I do break down pretty often. I have a, I have a breakdown just last week. Oh my god, I'm a fucking Apple app. I'm a, I'm an Apple headphone adapter. Okay, um, what are we talking about? Oh yeah, well I adapted though, and so I just did podcast of, like my Game Boy seemed to work okay for the most part, but not really. But like I would record since I had an Android phone, I can emulate stuff, so I can it records the audio from that and my voice, which is nice. Um, you know, so I, I did that. But I was like, I really miss playing stuff on my TV to record. And it's just, it was just nice having the, having my controller. Um, you know. Currently, though, um, the tripod is not a safe item for me to touch OCD-wise. It's sitting in a box up there. We used it for our wedding. And it was, like, in in the little field we got married in. And I, I need to clean it. It's dirty in my head, so I can't touch it. I don't want to really deal with it. Uh, my chair was too dirty to set in for the last year, 
but I've been sitting in that one. Sitting in that again, which is nice. Super fucking fun. Like, it is a whole different experience. I was playing Dragon Age in front with the chair. I can actually read the fucking text. And I was immersed more. Oh, that's great. And that's also sparked my interest in wanting to record like I used to, you know? But anyway, I was like, the last three days I've been troubleshooting this, like trying to fix it. I've downloaded like 15, 20 different apps. Um, my friend Ben, hey Ben, he gave me some recommendations for stuff. Nothing's working. And um, I just could not get, get it to record my voice and the game and background noise with my little mic. And in the my original fucking voice memo that I'm using, recorder thing, I was like, I looked up like, um, all of them, by the, all of them, all the apps I used, I looked at like, um, bit rates and fucking sounding samples things or something, and like fucking hertz, kilohertz, and uh, oh, there was one thing, I think, did I take a screenshot of it? It was funny, because like, I don't know, I still, I tried to research this, but I'm kind of... I, it, I, not a lot of it was clicking. It was really weird, you know? Uh, not that. Not that. Oh, yeah, this thing with, um, the sample rate. Number of samples and audio carried per second. What does that mean? Uh, DVDs are 48 kilohertz, blah, blah, blah. Just down here, 8 kilohertz. Sample rate has less bandwidth than modern telephone systems. Not suitable for any serious recording task. <laughs> oh, I thought that was really funny. I'm gonna try to record. I wanna, I wanna do some 8 kilohertz, see what that does. I didn't test it, uh, test that yet. But I was fucking around with all the settings and, and different bit rates and higher quality, nothing was working. I was fucking around with the, I found you can change the, the main audio source of this, of this app. And it was just on main, whatever the fuck that means. Main unprocessed? Way better, sounded way better, I thought. Um, uh, microphone? With, with my mic? Not very good. Sounded okay, but still no background noise. The camera? The camera, though, is what fixed it. I could record, I was testing it with, uh, with Sonic Advance. No, Sonic Adventure. Could hear me and hear Sonic. It was fucking great. I was like, oh, I, I fixed it. But, of course, I fixed it, but I can't use my goddamn microphone that I assume would sound better. So I just have to use the camera phone. Um, microphone. And I was just like, God damn it! like, <laughs> I can't catch a damn break. But... Maybe, so I was gonna test this last three days with Sonic Adventure, okay? Love me some Sonic Adventure. I played the Sonic Adventure on my phone, on a Dreamcast emulator, on my way to my wedding, on my wedding day. It was great. And the, my, my wife, my babe, even, even said she looked over at me in the passenger seat. I'm the passenger princess. She's like, will you get off that game and help me find out where we're going? Because we didn't know exactly how to get to the spot, you know? Like, babe, I'm just trying to collect these rings. Leave me alone. And, um, so she almost left me. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I wouldn't blame her, but she didn't. She fucked up and she didn't. And now I'm lo now I locked her down, so. You know? It's kind of a tragedy for her, I think. I'm not a catch. <laughs> no, I... I'm not... I don't want to be mean to myself. I'm a pretty good person. I, <laughs> I just drunk my own ego a little bit there. I, um, it's all jokes. I'm just kidding. I don't really, no, you know, none of that's for, for real. Um, let's test this. Uh, uh, <laughs> also today, I was kind of past my Sonic Adventure era of testing. I was going to test this with, um, Mega Man 8. I've been playing Mega Man 8 a lot. God damn, it's so perfect. It is the perfect accumulation of everything going right for any kind of media I've ever witnessed. Um, my favorite Mega Man game by far, a a as in 2D, like, side-scrolling games. That's part it, it is amazing. I could fucking gush about this game. I've only played about maybe half, I think. So unless the later half is just, like, a train wreck. Fucking, uh, an a, a awful landslide of disaster. I think this might be... It's everything is perfect with it. I love it. I love it dearly. Um, but I'm past that too. And that's why I downloaded, uh, I was looking at games. Cause <laughs> my Ben, hey Ben, my friend Ben, you know, I did a Heavenly Sword podcast 
where I bought him a copy of Heavenly Story because it was on his wish list, and I was testing it, and I played the first chapter, did a podcast about it, and um, I w- I've been wanting to play it ever since then. I want to get my own copy, and um, I guess he, I mean, he listened to the podcast, obviously. Hey, Ben. <laughs> and so he bought me a copy. It was the nicest thing, and um, which is good. He told me, too, because like, that day, I was gonna ask the babe, like, if is it in the budget if we could, if I could get a copy of this, you know? Because I was, like, dying to play it. And then he messaged me that night. I was like, hey, I got a surprise, you know? It's like, Holy shit, this is perfect timing. And so I hooked up the PS3 back up, because I, I've had my PS4 hooked up to play Dragon Age. I've played that, like, 12 hours. 13 hours I've put into it so far. And it's kind of great. A little slow. Main missions are, um... I've done, like, two main missions, three main missions. But I've met, um... I met my new husband, uh, oh, what the fuck's his name? Kunari? Is that right? The big horned guy? Iron Bull? He's fucking cool, I like him. Um, I'm a, I'm a big fan of the big muscles, you know? But Solace is a little, little fucking twink, so he's cute. Um, but there's also Sarah, who's like fucking sassy. Really sassy with her goofy bangs. I like her. And, um, I like everybody. There's Vivian, she's a cool mage. Looks like she could fucking stomp on me. And that's, that's great. Uh, <laughs> and Varric? He's a little he's a little too short, but I do like him. I don't know if I like Harry Harry Chess or not. It's getting kinda of, kinda of weird. But I that's why I'm playing the game basically. The romance options. Um it's pretty great. I turned off the party AI. I knew you could like tweak with the settings, but I never really bothered bothered with it till like um the last few times I played. I turned it off completely. So now it's just a turn-based uh, tactical RPG for me, and that's fucking great. It's great. Um, okay, let me let me stop this. Hang on. So if everything is working like it's supposed to, you should be able to hear me. You should be able to hear CS go in the background. Oh, I'm just player. This fucking game tried to get me to update it. Update it. One point one or some shit. When did this get an update? <laughs> God, I fucking love some CSGO. If I had a PC... God, this seems really loud. But I have to turn up loud. Oh, quick play. And we gotta play offline with bots, because, um... Although, I guess we could play online, couldn't we? Oh, I gotta update it first. I don't want to update it. Classic casual. What? Classic competitive. Demolition. Um, oh, classic competitive. Yeah, we'll, we'll do a little, um... We get a little dust too. Where's dust too? Yeah. Let's do let's do just a fucking hard bots. I'm good. I'm fucking good. If I had a PC, I probably would play CS:GO for at least an hour, and then I would probably lose, and people would be mean to me in the chat. I'd feel too anxious and probably never play it again. And um, but you know, for that hour, it'd be fun up until that. That would happen. Uh, I used to play the fuck out of Counter Strike on like my Xbox when I was a kid, just with bots and shit. And I got CS:GO, and I played this one a lot too with bots. It's just fun, you know. It's just a fun time. And um, I m- I remember playing. Well, let's do auto select over CT. I got a little P twenty two P two thousand. Okay, I don't know how to play. Okay, that's Crouch. That whipped me around for some reason. Can we buy? How did I get my gun out? Okay. Um, I remember playing this one time online. It was on Dust 2, actually. And I remember... Oh, people. Why does R2 flip me around? I don't understand. God, this is really loud. Oh, I killed Jeff. Circle, reload. What the fuck is this? What is this like? Val, why have you... Oh, I killed Derek. What is this like? Fucking... This, um... This this layout. This control layout. Oh, there it be. I played one time. With, um... Online. And I'll never forget it. Oh, they fucking planted. No, don't worry. I got it. All my fucking teammates just standing around. Oh! I died. There was another guy alive. I fucked up. Um, I play. No, don't defuse. The guy's behind behind the box. Oh my god, he's fucking. 
Kill him. He got a fucking triple kill. This fucking bot Joe. Are you kidding me? Jesus Christ. Can I, like, pause? Oh, I can buy things. Um, I played one time on... Let's still save. Online. And I remember it so vividly. It was on Dust 2. I remember we were a few rounds in. And, uh... The, um... I remember for some reason... Like, I was, la I was left last alive. I was last alive. And for some reason, my teammates started, like... Voting to kick me? I guess they didn't think. It was me versus five people. Hold on. It was me versus five people. And I killed, like, the first two in the fucking little hallway area. I killed, like, the last three on B, I think. I killed Derek again. Fuck Derek. And I fucking clutched it. And... Oh, got an AK. My favorite. And, um... What really pisses me off, though, is that, you know, I... I clutched it. The kick still happened. It still went through and they fucking kicked me. Or maybe I left. I don't remember. I don't remember exactly now, but I remember I was not in the game anymore. Aw, oh, fucking Tyler. Never met a good person named Tyler. Never in my life. The worst fucking name. Um, but that's not the only thing been annoying me, is this, this troubleshooting. Because along with it, on the PS3 here, I was looking at my games... And, well, for one, Mist, I love Mist. Mist, the, you know, the classic PC fucking, how did I bring up the buy menu again? Square? Oh, here we go. Yeah. Let's get a little, let's get a little, um, fucking oppen? Am I oppen, bitch? No, no. No, we just get a, get a little, um, get a little M4. Um, it was like the 31st anniversary of Mist recently. It's as old as me. I think it was like yesterday. And, like, the devs, I guess, like, dropped, like, some some merch or something. And I was like, man, I really want to get a 31st anniversary merch of, of Mist, you know? Oh, did everybody die? Everybody, I'm last alive again. Just me versus four. I don't give a damn. Oh, I saw one. No, 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 I'm panicking. Got him. Got him. I died. I Eric. I killed Eric. Got killed by Jeff. Um. I was, I was like, man, it'd be so cool to get, um, get that, you know. And I, sorry, I'm, it's hard to play this and talk. <laughs> and um, it was like twenty bucks or something. A P ninety or twenty five thirty. No, it's like thirty. There's like a mug too. And it said Mist, the prequel to Riven, which I thought was funny. And, uh, but then I was like, what if I just got, oh, fucking double kill with a P90? No, just one. I thought, what, it would be pretty cool if I, like, let me look up how much a copy of Mist is. Just, the PS1 copy would be great to own. I could actually play it and maybe beat it for once in my life. And it was actually, like, I think cheaper than the merch. I was like, I'm just gonna buy that then, you know, fuck that. And, um... So that's on my list. That's like the next... I don't know if that's the next thing I'll get, but that's up there. But then I fucking remembered... I bought... I have missed on the PS3. Except I bought... I, oh, I'm still mad about this. As a... When I was a youngling, I wanted to buy Mist on the my PS3. And I bought it. And to my dismay, I bought the fucking PSP version. Because there's a specific PSP version. <laughs> And I still, it's still on my, like, download list, but I don't have a PSP. At the time when I bought it, I didn't have a PSP. And, um, oh, this makes me so sad that I still, every time it's just, I look at this as, that's with fucking just shame and regret. My biggest regret in life, accidentally buying the missed uh, PSP version, not the PS1 version. Because I didn't have money to get both. And I never did get the PS1 version. Although, to be fair... The uh, PS1 version I saw digitally is only like six bucks. I could swing that now. I couldn't then, and I could now. So maybe I just buy that, you know? Oh, a guy? Guy? I killed Derek? Fuck Derek. Are they planting? Don't plant! No planting! Kill! I killed him! We won our first match.
How do I drop my gun? I want the AK. AK is way better. Um, so I'm still mad about that to this day. Um, but maybe maybe one day I can um. I'll I'll get I'll get missed to play. That would be that would be fun. Um. I also want to get. There's a few other games on the the PS3 store that I want to buy. It's kind of annoying to buy games on it though. Hold on, Jeff is pushing me. What? No, he shoot. He's wall banging me. This fucking guy. Oh god, I fucking died. Tyler fucking killed me again. Okay, the round, the round did start. I um, I stopped my recording so I could check to make sure it it sounded okay. And it wasn't too loud, because it sounds loud on my end. It sounds loud as fuck. Um, another thing <laughs> really pisses me off. The, um, I didn't buy anything. I didn't buy anything. I only have a knife. Oh, I got a M I picked up my team's M4. I died. <laughs> that was quick. Um, you know, if you were around, if you, if you had like a PS3 back in the day, I forget what the year was. When the, the PSN got hacked and was down for, like, several months. And, um, and then Sony got sued. Oh, I forgot I could just control the bots. Let's just watch Eric. Let's watch, uh, let's watch Eric, see what he does. Um, you know, and then Sony got sued for it. And in the settlement, because I was in the settlement, because it affected me, they gave away a bunch of, like, games, codes. And I remember, I think Little Big Planet was one of the games you could get. There was, a, there was a few options, but I picked the God of War collection, I think. And I was thinking, now that I got my PS3, be the perfect time to cash that in, because I didn't have a PS3 at the time. After it went during the settlement, like, period, you know? I don't I don't think I had my PS4, though. It might have been Xbox era. We're oppin'. We're fucking oppin'. And, um... So I never did use it. I don't know if the code would even be usable anymore. It's been a long time. And I was like fucking searching. I'm off and down the down the corridor. Come down, come down here, uh, terrorist scum. Of course they're not gonna. I don't hear any movement at B either. They're fucking A. God, I used to watch so much professional Counter Strike. It's kind of insane. I kind of miss it. It was fun. Oh, they got a bomb. They got the bomb down and everything. Oh, no, I missed. Bomb guy. I just, I wait here. I miss. I miss. I can't op. I died. Um. What was I talking about? <laughs> oh, I was, I was searching through my email to find the email that I got that they, you know, gave me the code with. And, um, could not for the life of, we're getting Desert Eagle. The Eagle time. Could not find it. I think it might have been my old email. Um, so I'm annoyed at that. Cause that sucks. Never got the got the God of War collection. I still really want to play God of War because I'm I'm pretty um vocal with my hatred. Hatred's a pretty strong word. My dislike for um God of War 2016. Guy, I'm running and shooting, and it's not good. One one bullet. No. One bullet's all I need, bitch. Oh, it was all I need. Headshot. Oh, and you have a gun, too, for me. You have a little SG. Reload. Um. But, you know, I like, um. I like the. The older. Oh, I killed that guy, too. Oh, another guy. He killed me. Two on two. I like the older versions of. Like the gameplay from God of War, the new the new one just looks boring. I don't know, but I I was thinking I've only ever played one, um, only one, like God of War game, in the classic like format or whatever, and that was Chains of Olympus on PSP. Never played any other ones, and so I was like, this collection would be perfect. But um, God, we're fucking one to eight. What is this shit? Is dust uh, T-sided? I forget. Um, so like that'd be perfect, but like, yeah, like I said, I could not for the life of me. Oh god, guys, guys! 
I killed Tyler. Fuck Tyler. If your name's Tyler, I hate you. I died. Oh, that'd be perfect, but... Oh, this is kind of... This is this is perfect, actually. Because while searching through my email, I, f I took a screenshot of this, which was funny, I thought, of... An old post on my old blog. And, um... What what was the what was the date on this shit? Oh, where's the date? I took the screenshot thinking, oh here it is, 2018, where I made the post. Don't know why, uh, what triggered this, but I was like, I'm being extra, I'm being extra gentle to myself today. And somebody's name, somebody with the name like what is this, um, so cruel guy, whatever, and he he just replied. Like you fucking should be shaking my fucking head. Like such positive, toxic positivity. No, it's not toxic. It's, that's more just aggressive love. <laughs> just, uh, that was funny. Because I looked up God of War and then... I don't... Wait, why was that even... Why was that there? Where did that go? God, I just... My pictures are gone. Everything's fucking... I don't know what the hell's going on. Um, yeah, I don't know why that was even there. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know what. It was on the same day. I, uh, I didn't take a screenshot of this one. I just remembered it. Oh, can I still buy? Negev time, bitch. Let's go. I'm fucking ready. Don't worry. I'm, you'll get assistance. I'm coming. They're all coming down. Negev! Killed one? Killed one. <laughs> Killed Eric. Um, on that same day, I guess... I made a post like, I would love to fight a god, and I know they would kill me, but, um, they'd probably kill me, but I'd love to fight a god, and <laughs> just the fucking confidence that you, an idiot, has to have to be like, I'd fight a god, and I'd probably lose, like, <laughs> of course you would, that's the whole thing, they're immortal and infinite power, and it's, that's really funny, it's, um, the same guy, or girl, you know, I don't know. The same guy, uh, same person replied to that, uh, same, that post that same day. I was like, I'd fight one too, whatever. That's why it popped up in my God of War search, which I thought was funny. <laughs> oh, Terrace win, 10 to 1. Okay, that's fine. We'll, we'll, we'll come back, you know, we'll come back. Um, maybe we get a little, maybe we get a little, um... Maybe we save. I'm really poor. Well, let's get a fucking... Let's get a Nova. Shotgun it. So, yeah, I thought, um... Yeah, I thought that was pretty funny. Um... Great smoke, guys. Great smoke. Throw a grenade? Okay, awesome. Can we bunny hop? Can I bunny hop in, in the PS3 version of CSGO? I don't know how to bunny hop. I just... You just be jumping, right? Like, is there anything special to it? Are they at B? Oh, they're all at A? Damn. It's fucking crazy. Switch to my knife. Maybe I get a knife kill. Oh, I see one. I see a guy. Hey, Nova! Killed one with the Nova. I got one. Almost killed him. Oh, my teammate got him up, though. Got him up. They're down the tool. Yeah, I got eight. I had eight shells. There's two people. Got one. Got the other. Well, my teammate did. Um, defuse. Oh, I'm defusing. I'm actually doing stuff. It's not the end. Calm down. I don't have a defuse kit. It blew up. It blew up. Oh, god damn it. Um, that was. What am I to do? How much better can I play than that? You know, get the fucking M4 and let's cry. Can I auto buy? What's auto buy give me? Does that give me like a helmet and stuff? Give me a fuse kit. I don't. Okay. Okay. <laughs> um. In other news, though, I started collecting Yu-Gi-Oh cards again. Oh, there's a guy. He killed me. And um, like I don't remember what triggered this. I mean, I just like Yu-Gi-Oh, you know? But, like, it was, like, a couple weeks ago. I was, like, I want to get... I've been wanting to buy, like, a pack 
just to open anyway. Could never find any packs. Um, I remember as a kid, I've only ever opened like two Yu-Gi-Oh packs. And I remember they were like the Sphinx guy. And there was a girl Sphinx lady too. And I, I remember I had two packs of them. And I opened them and they had the exact same fucking cards in both packs. And I was so bummed. But it had the, the Sphinx guy, the main like, he had like 3,500 attack. I, let me let me look up. Uh, let me see if I can find him. Um, yeah. Hopefully it doesn't like my phone get all scratchy. Um, Yu Gi Oh. Yu Gi Oh. Nope. Can't spell. Yu Gi Oh. Sphinx. Sphinx guy. Sphinx cards. Here we go. Yeah, Sphinx T Lily. Andro Finx. Where's the, the big guy? Yes, yeah, Dean and the Great Sphinx. Cool fucking card. Very bummed though that I it was just the both packs had the exact same which was weird, right? Oh fuck, I clicked the ad. Get out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, I cannot no, can nothing be adless? There's gotta be ads on every fucking thing. But like a couple weeks ago. Oh, we're playing the game. I f um Went to look at, see if they had Yu-Gi-Oh packs again. And, of course, they didn't. But I found a pack, or a box, of, like, a retro, retro Dex or something. Oh, my God. Fucking one-tap me? Derek? Jesus. Uh, <laughs> and it was only, like, 20 bucks. And so I bought it. What was it, the third, 20 or 25? Well, it was not expensive, but I bought it. And, um... I bought it besides getting this cool sweater that said Ratchet Club. That I, I did end up getting that the next week when we got a, another, like, got our paycheck or whatever. But I got the Yu-Gi-Oh pack or the card box and I was telling the babe, I was like, it's kind of useless to buy because it's just going to sit here, you know. <laughs> Jim. Jim, shoot. Jim turns around, the whole fucking terrorist squad just on the base, he died. 13 to 1. Um... I was like, yeah, it's kind of pointless to buy, but I just really, I just want it, you know, I want to, I want to buy it, you know. Um, so I got it, and it had three decks in it, and it was crazy to me that, like, it had Joey's deck, I think, because it got all the red eyes, black dragons. It had uh, Kaiba's deck, all the blue eyes, white dragons. And it had Yugi's deck with some dark magicians and, and the different, like, art stuff. And it had all three Egyptian god cards, too, and Exodia. I'm gone. These guys are fucking me up. Should have. I did not buy any any armor. I'm scared. I can barely see his head on on the on the thing. Get him. Get him headshot. I died. And uh. And then the other day, I was like, I had a really bad day. I was. I think. Did I have a panic attack? Maybe. Just really depressed. And I was like, you know what? I just I just pulled out my Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I was just looking at them. They instantly improved my mood. And it's just, and then it kind of hit me. It was funny because, like, I have all pieces of Exodia. They're not uh, holographic, which sucks. I'd like the holographic ones. I got all the Egyptian god cards, every artwork of Blue Eyes, White Dragon, and Dark Magician. And I was just thinking back, like, as a kid, I spent fucking weeks, mo or years even. Oh, we lost 1 to 15. Oh, that's the half. It's just the half. It's fine. We'll, we'll, we'll make it up in the on the terrorist side. Oh, I got the bomb. That's all we need. I want to get some little little tech nine. I like the tech nines. Nice. Um, yeah, I spent years trading with people and fucking hustling, making moves to get all these cards. Because as a kid, I had all that, all of them, you know. And it just, you know, I didn't have the money for packs. Like I said, I only opened like two packs my whole life. Never got a box of of cards, you know. What the, I'm gonna flank him. And it was just so funny to me that, like, I could have mitigated years of my life, life's work as a kid, had I have just had enough money to buy a $20 box of fucking car. Oh, I can just plant here. How do I plant? Oh, I'm planting. Fuck this. I forget. I forgot I was terrorist. I'm a terrorist, bitch. You can't stop me. Now I just gotta wait. Now the ball's in my court. Earth in their court, they gotta they gotta come to me. 
There's two of them left somewhere. I'm watching Cat. I got Cat hold, held down. Um, what's my other teammate? What's my teammate's name? Eric and Xander. Hey, don't worry about Cat. They're not coming here. They might be coming underneath though. No, you're, you're watching underneath. What are they fucking saving on the pistol round? What is this shit? I'm hunting them down. Oh, oh, they are underneath. I hear them. I see them on the map. Oh, I fell. I fell. Knife him. We died. We died by the explosion, but we won. We won the round. Um, yeah, I just thought that was that was really funny to me that, you know, I um, yeah, I could have. I could have made life a lot easier had I had had $20. That's kind of just life, though. Life would be a lot easier if you just had money, you know? Like, if I had money, I could go to therapy and get OCD help instead of having to fucking raw dog it and do it all myself, which I'm making good progress, you know? Damn good progress. Probably could have made a lot quicker progress with a lot easier time had I have had, um, you know assistance but you know, whatever fuck it i'm just shooting at b oh i killed one teammate eric what the fuck are you doing oh i had the bomb though i died um could buy new glasses haven't had new glasses in over 10 years Go to the fucking dentist um yeah you avoid a lot of a lot of a lot of heartache and struggles you had money Ooh, which, you know what? That reminds me. I watched, um... I was watching Game Grumps play... I'm going to be. Fuck y'all. I was watching them play Papers, Please. Which, you know, like a... A communist, you know, Russia border patrol type thing or whatever. Maybe I need a higher sensitivity. My sensitivity does not feel very high. Oh, you're at... You're at B, bitch. I don't like my crosshair either. It's dynamic and I hate it. Oh, I killed Derek at B. Fuck him. Plant the bomb. And, um... You know, I thought, like... I'm not gonna lie. It's not like I'm super knowledgeable about... You know, different forms of government. Um... I know a little bit. I know enough to where I'm not stupid like uh, some people. Fucking... It still blows my mind. Oh, we won. Blows my mind that I see, like, right-leaning people, like, fucking say, um, how they're, they, they despise commie, or not, uh, they despise socialism, but then they'll be like, gotta go get my unemployment. It's like, bitch, that's what social, you don't know what socialism is. Why do you, how do you meet, what do you mean you hate it? You don't know. Um, it fucking drives me up the fucking wall. But, you know, I'm not super knowledgeable. But I was under the impression of, oh, oh, I killed Jeff at B, fuck you. I plant. I was under the impression that communism was the, that, that the workers had the means of production, I thought was the whole point, like, and, um, and, like, I think it's a money, is it moneyless society? Everything's kind of provided for you, like, food and, and shelter and, and stuff? God, I'm having good luck at B, I'm going to B again. I don't know, but, I like I said, I'm not super knowledgeable, but I know the basics, I know a little bit. But I'm watching Papers, Please, and, you know, you get a salary from working at the, the labor lottery. And, um, which, I again, I thought was paperless or moneyless society, but I guess not. But what blows me away is that, you know, they make you work. And they provide you an apartment. Hmm. But you also have to pay rent? For the apartment that they provide you? Is that accurate? I need to look up more about different forms of government. I feel like that's important knowledge. Because apparently I'm not as knowledgeable as I thought. I damn have 12, 12k? 
God, the terrorism pays off. <laughs> it's in Counter Strike. Oh, don't worry, don't worry, Jeff. I'm here. No, I shot you, Jeff. I'm sorry. I killed Tyler. I died. Um, but like, what also really annoys me is people that, again, is people. You know, I'm taking control of Eric. Fuck you. I'm Eric. And um, <laughs> that you know, people think anything other than capitalism is de deplorable, you know, and it's fucking stupid. Oh, I killed, I killed Derek as, as Jim. Or no, I'm not Jim, I'm Eric. Am I Eric? I don't know. But, you know, they, they go on these tangents about, like, capitalism's the best, and, um, any other type of government is stupid and awful. And I'm just like, I'm just like, you know, it's not that capitalism is the best. There's, I mean, because there's a lot of bullshit with capitalism. You know, I'm not going to get into everything, all my thoughts. But, like, what annoys me, though, is that people forget, I guess, that you can have aspects of every type of government. Like, have all the best aspects, you know? Which is why, even though in America we're a capitalist, like, country... I think technically, but like we have aspects of socialism with our social welfare and, and unemployment and and stuff. Like that's good good things. Like why oh, we're on a fucking win streak, bitch. It's like it's weird to me that and even with communism, like there's uh, there's several companies that are are a co op. They're like cooperatively 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 owned by the workers, you know? They all own own a piece of it, you know? There's, there's... Like, I don't know, it's weird that they're like, oh, we gotta keep this type of government out of our government. Like, well, bitch, wh there's good, there's, there's some good in, like, every government form, technically, you know? I mean, maybe, maybe not a dictatorship. That wouldn't be as good. Uh, it would be better, though, if I was the dictator, honestly. Like, bro, if I was the fucking dictator, I was... I promise you, 95% of the, the country's problems would be solved. I would fix it all. I... Just, I'm, I'm, I'm wrapping it up, you know? I'm locking it down. I Fucking inflation, done. Not inflated anymore. Um, a little bit. You got, yeah, I think you have to have a little bit. Um... Unemployment, all, almost all the way down. You also need a little bit of that, too, I've heard. Um, you know, just... <laughs> criminals? Done. Not all criminals, just some of them. Oh, I saw three, four, cross at B. Okay, we're going to A, then. Go, team. It's good. I, I, I got the comms. I know what's going on. It's 9 to 14. What are we... What is it, what, is it best to 30? That can't be right, is it? I don't remember. Oh. Jake! Jake, don't kill me! Okay, fucking Joe. Joe, Jake, whatever. I could have knifed him too. I'm a fool. Um. You know, that also reminds me. I remember when I first got my PS4. The, the one time I ever had PlayStation Plus subscription. Was when I first got my PS4. Because I came. I came. <laughs> I bought the, the Black Ops 3 edition, so it came with a copy of that. And I couldn't play it online. I didn't know you had to have a subscription. God, I felt so awful. Like, because I felt awful that day because, you know, like I said, never had a lot of money growing up. I mean, this was when I was, like, an adult, basically. How old was I when I got PS4? I don't want to do the math. I don't care enough to do the math right now. But, you know, I bought... it was. I think we got, like, income tax or some kind of little influx of money. My mom buys me the PS4. It's great. I'm very happy. But then we, she gets it home, and I can't use my little tiny CRT... Um, CRT fucking VCR combo. It was, like, a little tiny, like, 13-inch TV, maybe? It was tiny. Couldn't use it because PS4 was only HDMI, no AV cables. 
And um, and then I couldn't play Black Ops 3 online because you needed a subscription to play it. And I felt so bad to be like, listen, I know, Ma, you bought me this expensive PS4, but I also need a new TV and a, a subscription. Felt awful. But she did. She bought it because she loves me. And um, once the guilt wore off, I, you know, had my subscription. I got um, one of the games I got was the Tropica 5 or 6 or something. At the time, I didn't like it. Because I thought it was like Civilization, which I love, but it's not. And I couldn't really get into it. But talking about the dictatorship. <laughs> and I've I've since like seen people. I've seen a few people like play it. Double kill, maybe? Fuck you, Joe. Fuck you, Joe. I have the bomb. I'll blow us both up. Fuck you. I peek around the corner. I got the AK. Oh, my teammate kills him. Nice. And, um, yeah, I've since, like, seen some gameplay of it, and I, I kind of get it now, and I wanted to, I want to give it another try. If I ever catch it on sale, um, that'd be fun to play on, like, the podcast. That'd be the perfect podcast game. Does anyone want to, <laughs> is any brand listening that would like to sponsor me, um, and give me money for an ad? And so I can buy Tropica and play it on the podcast. You know, in all honesty, I don't think I could in good conscience ever accept a brand deal or a sponsorship ad thing. I despise fucking advertisements. I don't think I could do it. I think I would feel too hypocritical. Oh, it's just oh, it's me and, and me and three? Oh, Hank. Hank, Hank shotgunned some people back there. Oh, I see one guy way back there. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you, Tyler. You can't stop me. God, Hank, Hank, Hank. Oh, behind me. No, 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 no. Just hide. Just hide. They gotta come to me. I just gotta watch this bomb. I gotta protect the bomb with my life. It doesn't matter if I die. As long as the bomb doesn't get defused. Teammates, help me. Oh, he tried to defuse. I got him. Counter, counter terrorist. Trophy, bitch. I got a trophy. Oh, we win. Ooh, 13, 14. We are making the comeback. That's great. Oh, this is this is more fun than I expected. I do... Like... Because I was trying to think of something to play to test. But I wasn't really in the mood for... Like, a story game. But I also didn't want to play, like... Like I said, I was going to play Mega Man, but platformers are like the worst thing to play for the podcast, I feel like. I've always wanted like a good multiplayer game to make content for. That fucking Deadlock, the new Deadlock looks really good. I've never really played a MOBA. I used to be really into Smite. Oh, I fucked. I fucking, I fucked. I died. I used to be really into Smite. I got the gold skin for Fenrir and... There's someone else I got the gold skin for, too. I played a lot of that. Despite the massive anxiety that I had. I never did get to play the MOBA mode, though. I only played, like, the little... Like, the little team deathmatch type. It had, like, your little minions and stuff. But, like, it wasn't, like, the actual MOBA of, like, the whole big map. And, um, having to farm for, uh... Like, like the jungle and shit. I never got to play, like, an actual MOBA. Deadlock looks really fun, though. It looks more, um, user-friendly. Oh, it's 1v4. Oh, I, Jim, do I take you over? No, I trust Jim. I trust Jim. He's got this. Bought Jim. He missed those shots, but that's fine. You turn your back to the ter the counter-terrorist. Okay. Oh, you killed him. Good job. Good. Go, Jim. Go. Don't let him defuse. Okay, he's dead. But, um, they have plenty of time, probably. Do they? Nah. Come on, blow up. They fucking got it. God damn it. Um, um besides that though, the Oh, match point. Oh, if they win one more, they they win the whole game, I think. We gotta op. We're oping. Can I give someone else the bomb? Um, that new Yakuza game got announced. 
It was like pirates, pirates in Hawaii or something. And which sounds great. I'm just shooting at the fucking double doors. Oh, I saw a guy. Come on. Oh, I almost flicked him. I'm fucking, uh, I was gonna say Cliffy B, but I don't think that's the guy's name. Who's the guy that... There was a Counter-Strike guy I was gonna, I was gonna mention. I forgot his name. I suck at opping. I suck at this game. But I play anyway because it's pretty fun. Oh, there's a guy. What? He moved at the last minute. I'm gonna Glock you. Fucking Glock, Glock, bitch. Let's go. Where'd he go? He runs. I just shot a dead body. Oh, I have the bomb. I forget. Okay. Got the sound effects in this game in, in, in CSGO. Fucking, oh, it's so good. Peek the corner, bitch. See if you don't get shot up. He doesn't care. He's not gonna, he's not gonna peek. I'm just gonna run to B. I'm scared. I just gotta plant and then, then, then protect the bomb and then we win. But yeah, the I really want to play. Oh, it's just me. Me versus two, though. I think I think I got it. Yeah, the the yakuza and pirates in Hawaii, fucking sounds amazing. I've always wanted to get into yakuza. I think I would really like it. I'm gonna plant the bomb right in the middle of the of B and hide behind this blue car back here. They won't see me. They won't see me, and then I'll just shoot them. Just shoot them with the op. You know, it'll be fine. What I really want to play is this, the first Like a Dragon Yakuza. Because, um, Ben... Hey, Ben. Yeah, <laughs> he was telling me that... Because I knew some of them were turn-based, and that's the ones I wanted to play. And someone explained this to me before, which ones were which, but I didn't remember which ones. I got Joe! Trying to defuse on me. Um... Oh, I got Eric! I, can, I wrapped them both up. To be fair, I shot. I missed. He did not react. Um final round oh wait if we win we can tie it oh fuck we can't win then i think i think um if they lost one more round we could have won this if we won this match or this round i think all we can do is tie it now was there overtime was there overtime i don't know but um but my friend ben explained it to me again with um the first Like a Dragon is turn-based. Um, there's another one that is, too. I cannot remember which one he said, though. Oh, God, they're all here? They're all trying to flank us? I suck with the op. I suck. Oh, oh come on. I'm so... I'm panicking. 1v2. 1v1. I gotta win this for us. How do, I, how, do I, how do I drop? Give me the AK. Fuck that op. I know he's around here somewhere. Hit my shots. Come on. Oh my god, it's Tyler. It's goddamn Tyler. I'm gonna flank him. He won't know I'm behind him. Oh, there he is. Okay, he's running. I'm gonna run. I'm running to A. I have the bomb. I'm gonna plant it. Wait, yeah, I really... Uh, anyway, yeah, Ben... <laughs> Hey, Ben. He told me, um, the Yakuza game is turn-based because the main character sees or imagines combat as Dragon Quest. And that's, like, canon that he sees it as specifically Dragon Quest, which I thought was amazing. And it made me want the game even more now. And the first Yakuza, like a dragon, it's only, like, 20 bucks, like, base price, I think. Would love to get that one of these days. It's on my list. Along with 5,000 other games. <laughs> but I'm also playing 5,000 games. So it's like I can't really buy games. I can't afford to buy more games. Because I'm playing too many. And I don't have a lot of money. But I have a little more, little, little money to buy games. Ooh. One shot Tyler in the head. After I missed the first three shots. I was 24 and 17. And I tied it. For, I think, um, I think I did good with hard bots. Yeah, pretty good, I think. Um, get me out of here. I'm done. Exit to main menu, yes. Um, god. CSGO is still really fun. 
But yeah, my, like, sleeping's been all fucked up. And, um... The last, like... Like I said, the last, um, all week this week... I've been... Troubleshooting. Trying to fix the, my podcast stuff. Because I wanted to do, like, something. I wanted to make some kind of content. Um... Before I go to sleep at noon. But I also just haven't been feeling good. I'm feeling a little under the weather and stuff. Like I said, but um this list of topics is um increasingly increase let me turn this PS PS3 off actually. I'm done playing. I'm done playing. My arm my hands are sweaty. Knees weak arms are heavy. Um God I'm hot too. Why am I hot? I'm so hot and sweaty. Um, I'm gonna have to put in some background music now, I think, for this section. Because now I don't feel like playing anything else. I can't. I can't make it. I can't make it. Hmm. Um. What else was I gonna... Let's look at the state of play stuff. I, I, I peeked. I did peek at it. Um. I did not see anything too crazy. Um, state of play 2024. I never watch them. I just look up like, like some like the an article later. Everything revealed in State of Play PlayStation blog. Yeah, let's go to that. Hmm, that's pretty cool. The Ghost of Tsushima is getting a sequel. Um, was it Ghost of Yo- Yotai? That looks pretty cool. It's got a, a girl protagonist, which I'm a fan of. Um, some people aren't because they're <laughs> fucking insane. Oh, it's gone woke. It's a woman. This has just ruined my historical accuracy. Will you fucking sit down? Women have always existed, you weirdo. Um, Astrobot DLC, apparently. Ooh, new speedrun levels. That could be fun. Hmm. The thing I was most excited for that I'm really bummed about, because I don't have a PS5, is, um... The PAL world is coming to PS5, apparently. I think it came out that day that the state of play happened. That, um... God, PAL world... I wanted PAL world... I wanted to play it ever since it first came out. And it looked... Because it looks really fun. They're getting sued by Pokemon now, which is insane. I hope they win. Like, Pokemon... I love Pokemon. Don't get me wrong. Big Pokemon stand over here. But, like, they need some competition, for one. And two... When I saw Pal World, it it's distinctive enough. They didn't need to sue them for copyright infringement. Well, they they're suing them for not copyright, like for I think it was for like patents. I think there's some video game like some specific patents that they have. I think it's weird to have a patent for like a mechanic in a game. Like that's why that's why we can't have a nemesis system in any other game besides fucking Shadow of Mordor. Which I love. I love Shadow of Mordor. I downloaded a demo of Shadow of War, the sequel, and I fucking did not like it. The combat was, er, yeah, just like walking around felt really sluggish and weird. I thought maybe it was just the demo. Um, maybe the full, maybe the full game is they patched it and stuff and didn't bother to do the demo. Maybe, but like, I d- I didn't even fin- I I played for like ten minutes and quit. It was, uh, but my guess. From what I th- what I know, what I've seen, I bet you they're suing specifically for the fact that you th- you throw a pokeball, a pal ball at a pal at a pal, and it it's like a pokeball and a pokemon. That's my guess is like the main backbone of their lawsuit. I think. Um, but it, it was weird that I was I well I guess it's not weird because I was thinking about pal world because of the lawsuit stuff. I started watching um. A let's play of it again and then you know next fucking day it gets announced for ps5 one day one day i'll get a ps5 and get it horizon zero dawn remastered who cares remaster something that needs remastered not a fucking game that came out like last year i mean i know horizon zero dawn's a little older than that but did not need a remaster um i still i still think people fake like this game don't know i don't see the appeal I, it, it's the the most bland story I've ever seen in my fucking life. One of the coolest concepts I've ever seen. Fumbled so hard. I do own this game. Sony gave it out for free during COVID. 
Maybe it's time to finally play it. That'd be fun to play on the podcast. Maybe I'll do that. Um, it's Horizon Zero, Horizon Adventures. I do like Alloy, though. She's a really cool protagonist. I like her. And Robot Dinosaurs. There's a lot of the game I do like, but I, I can't remember specifically. I just remember watching a Let's Play of it and being really bummed by the story's generic tones and directions, you know? PlayStation 5 Pro, who cares? Who? No one even owns a PS5 besides Ben. Hey, Ben. And <laughs> the PS5 Pro is like $800 or some shit. I can't afford a regular one. This is, this is good, though. I've always looking forward to when they release, like, the Pro versions of consoles. Because that normally means the base one gets cheaper. That's one... I didn't get my PS4 till the PS4 Pro, I think, came out. So, I'm looking forward to that, because if the, the base one goes down, maybe, maybe I can get it. PS5 Chroma Collection. Cool, I guess. Who cares? I mean, people do like some fuck... I do. I like some limited edition consoles, too. God, I want, um... I want one of those Halo Xboxes. The original Xboxes. Um, God, I used to have a, uh, I had a, a special edition console one time. I think I had a Halo, did I have a Halo 3, 360 at one point? But it was broken? I think the disc drive was broken, because disc drives always break on me. Alan Wake 2, The Lake House, yes. Alan Wake Expansions. Oh, I'm so, I'm pumped for that, it's gonna be fun. Um, well, I can't play it, but... Hopefully, someone I, I, I like will, like, pl like, do a let's play of it or something. Ooh, Ben. Hey, Ben. <laughs> That's the name of this episode. I know my friend Ben, he, I know he played Alan Wake on the on his podcast. Um, I think he did. There's already some DLC for it. I think that he might have played that. I need to listen to that. God, I still want to listen to or watch Skelly play RimWorld. And Lockathor play Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth 2 or whatever the fuck it's called. God, too much stuff. Um, Arch Age Chronicles? What the fuck is this? What is this like Dragon's Dogma shit looking? It looks interesting. I just, I just see a picture. Can we get a... Um, Dragon Age the, Van, the Vanguard. Oh my god. I'm a big Dragon Age fan now. I went from... It was okay... And, I went, and then it was like, I don't really, it's not my thing. Then I was like, maybe it is. It's kind of cool until, like, I'm fucking all in on Dragon Age. Dynasty Warriors Origins. I've only ever played the Dynasty Warriors on uh, Dynasty Warriors Advance. I do like that one, though. Fantasia Neo Dimension. Okay, and it's fucking Genshin Impact, okay. Ooh, the father of Final Fantasy. Hiro Nobu. Um, Sakaguchi. Oh my god. Oh, you, you, okay, wait a minute. I wrote this off too quickly. <laughs> Just from the picture, I, it looked Genshin Impact y, but it's actually Final Fantasy E. Okay. I'm interested. Fear the Spotlight. Ooh. Some more creepy creepiness. I'm a fan. Um, epic split screen mode to Lego Fortnite in October. Okay, who cares? I mean, a lot of people play Fortnite still. It's insane. Hell is us. Is this just The Last of Us? Is that what they're trying to capture? Um, Hitman World Assassin VR. God, I want to play some VR one day. Is this one like VR? Like you can actually walk around and stuff? Because I know they had like the sniper VR thing. Now, this is interesting. Soul Reaver Remastered 1 and 2. I... I remember playing Soul Reaver as a kid. I remember liking it a, a good bit, but it was never one game that stuck with me for my whole life like other games, like, um, like Akuji the Heartless, or, you know, like fucking, or Tomb Raider, or like, uh, Myst, or any, like, game, well, Myst, I didn't play on PS1, but, like, it, it just, it wasn't a game that, that really has, to, has, like, I, I find myself thinking about a lot, you know? I just, like, I get reminded, I'm like, oh, I played that one time, and it was okay. I know people fucking love it. Wouldn't mind revisiting it, though. I wouldn't mind playing it again. 
Lunar Remaster Collection. It's like a JRPG, I think. Um, I fuck with some JRPGs, so this would be cool. Wouldn't mind it. Metro Awakening VR. Or VR stuff. I usually just write off VR stuff because I don't have a VR headset. Um, that'd be fun to have one day. Monster Hunter Wilds. I do like some Monster Hunter. I only ever played the 3DS one, but I fucking loved it. There's Pal World. God, one day, maybe. Stellar Blade. Stellar Blade Nier Automata, what? Stellar Blade X Nier Automata DLC. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Um, Stellar Blade looks kind of... Didn't really look all that special to me. Um, Nier Automata, though, I gotta... That's been on my list for a long fucking time. It was either that or Blood Vein. Code Vein. That one Christmas... And I've got Code Vein and was upset. Well, that was because my controller was broken. I couldn't play. I couldn't turn left at the time. Then I couldn't turn right later on. But now I have a new control. I could play it. But I still think I would prefer Nier Automata. The Midnight Walk. Um, what is this? I saw... I can't remember... The developers, I like, I saw... They had made something else. Oh, the... Oh, the random oh, fuck, what was lost in random or something never played it but it's been on my wish list for a long time because it's always on on sale on the switch for like 99 cents teenage mutant ninja turtles shredder's revenge radical reptiles oh they got a fucking girl ninja teenage mutant ninja turtle that's cool and this fucking guy with the with the crop top he's cool too Ooh, Sonic X Shadow Generations. I'm always up for some Sonic. Powers of Ag... Ag Haspa? Open World Adventure. First look at it, city building. That's, okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, that's it. So pretty, pretty interesting things. I mean, you know, people want Bloodborne. Um, you know, I think... Well, for one... People, I know people really want, really clamoring for a fucking Bloodborne Remastered. And, I mean, that would deserve it more than a Horizon Zero Dawn. But, I'm I'm still annoyed that people are like, they scoff at 30 FPS like it's unplayable. It's perfectly fine. You can play it right now. You can go play it on the PS4. It's great. But, it would be nicer to have it more accessible to like PS5 and... 60 frames a second would be, would be would be good too, just to add. I don't think it's necessary. But, it, you know, it's not... I wouldn't not play it in 60 FPS either, you know? Although I actually might. I'm a weirdo. I <laughs> I genuinely am, am weird. And prefer the slower clunkiness of 30 FPS. But, um... I'm convinced that... You know, I know... Like, Sony... They're not dumb. I know they must know that people want Bloodborne Remastered. Or, or a 60 FPS patch at least. There's there's gotta be more stopping them behind the scenes that people don't like. Cause I see people say all the time like man Sony's so stupid they could just break in money if they just did this thing. And it's like I'm sure they've considered it. But I'm sure there's something stopping them like I don't think it's a lack of I don't think it's ignorance you know. I think it's, um, I think they may, maybe they lost the fucking source code. Maybe some of the, like, important aspects of it are tied up legality-wise, like, other companies own them, own, own the assets or something, like, uh, they don't have the, um, a license to use them anymore or something, like, not, and not something easily to, replaceable, like, um, maybe there's, like, like a, a track or two of music they could just, like, replace. Like, I'm thinking, like, maybe whole slews of of assets, maybe. Or maybe FromSoft retain the IP for it to some degree, but maybe not enough to, like, make stuff on their own. Maybe it's just kind of, like, in the limbo of ne no one owns it or something, you know? There's got to be more to it than just them being stupid and not doing it, you know? I'm not convinced. Um, God, it has been a long podcast. Um, I did, I did touch on, like, most of the topics I want to talk about, I think. Um, and my throat kind of hurts, and I do still feel really rough. I want to lay down, I think, and, and watch, um, I finished watching the streamer play, do a playthrough of Frostpunk. 
that he played in anticipation for Frostpunk 2. And um, then that that finally came out and he streamed it. Um, he, he I watched the first like series of the first game. It was like six months ago he played it, but I just I just now finished it. And um, so I'm, I think I might watch Frostpunk 2. Do I, what else? I don't know if I want to watch that though. I still want to play. I want to play Heavenly Sword. I want to start a new game. I think it's been a while since I did the the podcast for it, so I can't really remember much. But I've been too focused on Mega Man 8. God, I love Mega Man 8. It's got like the music's perfect, the levels are like the perfect length and difficulty, and the art style is just gorgeous. And they have the fucking this anime cutscenes that I, when I saw the opening cutscene, I was like, oh, there was a Mega Man anime that I didn't know about apparently. But no, they made these cutscenes specifically for the game, and just oh, it's so perfect. It's great. The best Mega Man. Um. <laughs> But I've been I've been too focused on that to play Heavenly Sword. <laughs> well, it's just like last time, right? That I when I got my PS3, what I played um I I wanted to play um oh fuck, what was it that I like I had Metal Gear Solid 3 and um oh fuck, I can't remember Demon Souls. I, I thought there was like a specific game I wanted to play, but I ended up just playing Katamari the whole time. <laughs> That was, and I do love some Katamari. God damn it. But I also want to hook the PS4 back up because I want to play more Dragon Age. Because that's... I'm, I'm into some interesting bits on that. I still want to play more Okage Shadow King too because that game is fucking amazing. It's just brilliant writing and creepy Tim burton ass art style that I love and hate because it's really endearing but also terrifying and disturbing. Um... It's like funny and unsettling. It's weird. I only played that like four or five hours. I need to play that some more too. You know, I looked up or I, um, I was thinking like, what's o- what's Okage mean? Like, I know Hokage from the n- fucking Naruto. Well, I guess I don't know what it means, but I know the word. But like Okage, and then I know Kage, I think it's Shadow in Japanese, right? From Ghost of Tsushima. You name, you name, name your horse that. I don't know what the O would be, but is it just Shadow Shadow King? Like, what does it mean? Oh, that'd be. I gotta play that some more too, and Commandos too. There's too many stuff, too much stuff. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna wrap this up. I'm gonna lay down and cry, and <laughs> I need some tea actually. I need a cookie. That's what I need. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this um this this podcast. Um. Oh, I also was playing Tenchu. Oh, Tenchu. Oh, that's a fun... Oh, that's a vibe. That is a, that is a fun vibe. Um, Did not even finish the first mission. That game's difficult. I did I did beat the boss, though. And then the, the fat guy, the merchant, evil merchant, ran off, and I was searching for him, and then I, I got killed. Um, I gotta go. I gotta go. I'm talking too much. I'm just rambling now. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this, um, this, this, this podcast episode. I would do longer because I had some more topics and other things, other games I want to play. But like, I guess I don't feel very good. And I wanted to do something today and test this to see if I got the settings right and if it sounds better than normal. So let me know in the comments. Um, but I've been Deej. This has been Happy Critter Inc. And um, yeah. Da, da, da. Oh my God! There was one, one more thing just before the podcast ends. Um. That I forgot to mention. It was important. Because, uh, you know, I said before, I also said I wasn't going to talk about the, the content I'm going to, I plan on making. Because, see, the thing is, I have all these plans for the content, and then I don't like to talk about them. Because if, if it comes to, like, I decide I don't want to do it, or I can't do it, I feel bad about, like, I've, I've teased it, but now I, I can't go through with it. Or, you know, I like to keep it. Keep it, keep it hidden, and it, be surprised it's as fun, um, but also, I don't have a lot go, going on to talk about um, in, in my general life, and that's one of the things that I do have to talk about, so I do want to talk about it, um, so, <laughs> I swear, I'm, ne- I'm not going to talk about any stuff anymore after this, but, you know, I had my big video project I haven't been able to do yet, because Insomnia. It's also just scary. It's a scary project. A very big. It's a, it's a daunting task. 
both like demanding of, of work wise and physical wise and life wise is scary um it's gonna be if i can do it it's gonna be great though i think um but i was i said i was gonna start a new series and i i just wanted to that is gonna happen i really want to start the series um but i haven't been able to do that either because i just haven't really felt too great that's why i wanted to do a podcast because podcasts are a little less effort i think i can just talk about whatever and it's it's fine um then i just put it in the fucking video editor with it and make the 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 the, the thing is the the background picture and and then it's done you know no, nothing to it um but the series i want to start i want to give a little a little teaser here at the end for that so it uh, uh without directly saying what it is it's gonna be it's the opposite of calm legs opposite of calm T- just take that in and see, see if you can guess what it is if you <laughs> It's not very clever. <laughs> you can easily, very easily, decipher that fucking clue. <laughs> you know, speaking speaking of calm legs, though, have you ever had restless leg syndrome? God, it's the worst. Like, we like you know, it happens to me sometimes at night. I can't sleep because my legs are just like, you like they, you feel like you need like they're you gotta move them. And you, they can't sit still, and they, they kind of hurt, and just kind of feel weird and achy, and just... Oh, that's the worst. Oh, I fucking hate it. What? I don't even know what to do about it. You just... I mean, I kind of do what I do with most things in life, is just suffer through it. I don't really know what else to do about things. It's the worst. Um, yeah, calm, calm legs. Uh, <laughs> it was stupid. I was going to do the first episode of that this week. Um, at some point, because I want to make it like a long first episode, like a good like two hours long, maybe. But I just haven't um got around to it because I was troubleshooting the podcast stuff. But I also haven't really felt like good enough to like do proper like recording stuff. So maybe m- maybe before the week's over. I don't know. Is it Wednesday? I don't know. But or Thursday? I don't know. But um, but yeah, just I want to throw that in there. Um. Yeah, that now is now it's the end. Da da da. Get the get him get me out of here. <laughs>